I'm gonna show you guys my favorite way of joining squares together. So as you can see, I've already got some done here. So I'm going to chain one and then I'm just going to add in the next piece. And so I'm gonna put it through the back loop of the one side and the front loop of the other side with my wrong sides facing each other. And then I'm just doing a slip stitch through there. So, so that's through the back loop of the first one and through the front loop of the second one and then just a slip stitch. So back loop, front loop, slip stitch. And I do this all the way across. And when I get to the corner, I chain one and then add the next block in without cutting my yarn. So you can see here, I've got a few rows done together. And so I just do them all across my straight across rows. And then you can see there's like little gaps from the vertical rows. So then I go through and I do the vertical rows. So I start off by slip stitching into the back loop of the first one and then slipping into the front loop of the next one in the corners. And then I just continue what I was doing, back loop of the front one, front loop of the back one, and then a slip stitch. And I continue doing this until I get to the corner of my first square. So once you get to your corner, as you can see I'm here, um, we slip stitch into the chain we did and then we just go into the next stitch and we just continue slip stitching across front loop, back loop. This is my favorite method of joining squares together because there is so much less ends to weave in once you're finished. So go try it on your next square project.